Hey guys, quick note, this video is sponsored by Payability. Why am I in front of a Dollar Tree talking about Payability? Because if you're an Amazon seller and you want money the next day, not in two weeks, the next day for the things that you sold, they're the ones who can help you. And if you sign up using my link, you get 250 bucks for free. Not a bad deal, right? This video woo, right here is about the $19.08 of things I bought from Boom right there, Dollar Tree. What am I gonna do with it? I am going to sell it, sell it on Amazon, and we're gonna see just how much money I can make, and more importantly, how much money per hour I can make. What do you think it's gonna be? Let's find out. But guys, also, at the end of the video, I will be telling you a secret bolo that I sold this week for over 50 bucks. You wanna find that out? Stick around for the whole video. See you guys in a minute. All right, guys, we are back in the warehouse. I listed everything right here at my computer. It took, it's taken me 46 minutes from start to finish. The Dollar Tree's like eight minutes away, so it's close to me. But yeah, 48 minutes, it's all new. And so the only, I, I already list, so I'm gonna show you the prep I had to do. Uh, let's see, it's part of a shipment. I already had $217 net profit listed. Now it's at 285, so that puts us at what? 60, 68 dollars, right? 68 dollars and 60 cents. Uh, so we're looking at 68, we'll, we'll just say 60 bucks. 60 bucks profit an hour doing this. And you couldn't do it all day. Like you couldn't make $80,000 a year going to one, one Dollar Tree and buying their stuff. But if you shop at Dollar Tree or if you live by one, maybe do this twice a week, 10 times a week, whatever. Maybe find these items and you're gonna see some of these are different at each store. Maybe go around to four of them and there's your extra 400 bucks a month. There's your extra car payment, whatever it is. It's totally possible and I'm gonna go through each item now and show you just what they are and how simple it is. The first one right here is a book. I don't know if you know this, many Dollar Trees sell books, brand new books. Now you have to watch out uh, some of the books, as I showed in the in the, the video before this, they have a mark right here, or maybe up here in the top. That's called the remainder mark. So what happens is when a bookstore or a publisher has too many copies, they donate or give them away or sell them in bulk. But to ensure, or at least they think they're ensuring, um, that it's not being sold again as new, they ruin the book, or at least they mar it up like that to make it seem like it's not new. These books are all in pristine condition, and yes, I will sell them as new. There's a lot of people who say, no, you can't sell books as new if you don't have invoices, and that's totally true for like textbooks or like top 25,000 sales rank books, but this is right around a million. Um, there's no doubt in my mind I can sell this book as new, and I'm only making a couple bucks on this, but you know, when it's, it, when it's said and done, it took me what? Yeah, like I said, 46 minutes right, right around there, you know, to, to find this book. You just put the title in your phone, you see what it's going for, and then you sell it. And when you're buying things for a dollar, it's very easy to make money. More books, I got these next two books right here. Uh, the Wonder Trail. Again, only making like four bucks profit on those. Not the, not the best in the world, but they're new and they'll sell fast. A few more books I got. Probably the best book out of all of those would be either this one or this one, Updraft or Mother of the Unseen World. And they're each going for around $19, or that's what I'm gonna sell them at at least. So on these two books, I'll make I'll make closer to like $10 profit. On the rest of them, between like three and $4. Eh, not the best in the world, but it adds up fast. And I was just there for a half hour, and so to go in, see those, and to get out, that shows you that, yeah, these these Dollar Trees are gonna have a good selection of books to sell. And one, one more caveat I said, okay, right? So on, on the back of these, uh, you see this bestseller uh, ASTD sticker. That's the remainder books I was telling you about earlier. These were all bought in bulk and then sold to people who in turn are gonna sell them at like an Ollie's or a dollar store or whatever. They all have the same UPC code because they're all being sold for the same price at, uh, at the Dollar Tree, $1, no, you know, duh. 
beneath this is the actual UPC code. Uh, the ISBN is what you're going to want to look up in these because there's a sticker over the uh, over the UPC code. That's right here in the front page. You can also just look up the title. That's what I did for these. I just said, okay, uh, The Witches, Stacy Schiff, hardcover. And that was, it's not as fast as looking it up with the UPC code, but it's, it's just as accurate. Uh, and it's probably only like five or six seconds slower per book. And if you're at a dollar tree where there's like only 50 or 100 books, it isn't that big of a deal. The next one is these, these bad boys. I bought four of these and I could have bought more, but I just didn't because the, the sales rank is not too hot. It's like 300,000 in, uh, in home and gardening or in gardening or whatever it is. Uh, so probably these will sell in a month or two. Uh, I was the, I'm the only listing on them. And the issue was, is when I scanned the barcode, two variations came up. These are purple. There was also green and blue. I only picked purple because green and blue both had people who were selling them. They were selling them at around six bucks. I have these all at uh, $11.95. So I should make around $6 on these after fees. So six times four is 24. Um, you know, not, not a huge amount of money, but for four bucks, do you want to have that be, uh, you know, converted through the magic of Amazon to 24? I think you do. Brillo pads. Uh, a lot of people were saying in the last video, oh, I'm, I'm gated for all this stuff. All these Dollar Tree items that you showed us, I can't sell because they're Barbie or because they're um, Tupperware or Rubbermaid or whatever it is. These items, every single one of you can sell. Brillo is not a gated brand. I checked. I just checked. It's not gated. Any of you can sell these. They're going for about $7 on Amazon. So, you know, $1 into 7 you make about 3 bucks profit. Mm, not the best, but if you're paying for your groceries, who cares? The next up is this, uh, Ultramax 3-in-1 body armor, uh, whatever. It says bonus trial size up here. Don't let that scare you. Uh, I think these were initially actually a trial that they gave away for free to people. They had excess. They sold the excess to Dollar Tree or to some liquidator of, uh, of sorts. Uh, there was no listing for it on Amazon. That was crazy to me. There was no listing at all. But I've made Arm and Hammer listings before, um, I, and I, I, there's three. There's a three pack for sale currently on Amazon for twenty bucks for three of these. I have each one of these listed at seven ninety nine. I'll make three or four bucks off of it. I paid a dollar for it. Again, not great, but uh, it's this is how you. You're not going to find home runs at the dollar store. You're going to find things that are easy, easy for you to replenish, either ordering in the store or just ordering online. Because once you find what you can sell. You can go to DollarTree.com and buy a hundred of them, free shipping. So that's 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 how this type of you know side hustle uh, matures. When you sell this too, take some tape, put tape over this so it doesn't get out, and then um, put it in a poly mailer like this. I don't have it in a poly mailer yet, uh, just because I started the video too early. But that's how I'm going to ship this out. Uh, again, not the best thing in the world, but. Like I said, when you add these things all together, it's 60 bucks, $60. And the last thing, <laughs> I kind of like these. Two of them, two little uh, poop emoji, whoopee cushions. Um, the sales rank is below 100,000, so they're gonna sell as soon as they hit the shelves. There was only two left. These are the kind of toys that I would have bought 500 of, you know, if I wasn't making a video and inevitably, <laughs> inevitably all this shit, the, the, the price is gonna tank on it, but, um. Now is my like obligatory, don't do this because you're trying to do what I do. Do this because I'm teaching you a process and the process can make you money. A uh, little yell that I always fit in my videos because realistically, if you go out and buy these same things I bought, you're not going to make any money because there's like five or six people who are going to do that and they're going to tank the price. They're going to make the price go down to where it's not profitable. Do what I'm doing. Take your phone, you know, go there, da, 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 go uh, download Profit Bandit or the Amazon Seller app, scan the barcodes, look the items up, and then different things, sell different things than I'm selling, and you'll have your own 60 bucks an hour. The issue though, right, is, uh, is that these might take a while to sell. They might take a while to sell, and even then, you're only being paid every two weeks. What a hassle, right? Well, that's where payability comes in. Payability, right there. 
They sponsored this video and they help you get paid the next day. That's right. If I sell this on Amazon, I don't have to wait two weeks to, to use to get the money. I can get paid the next day. They charge 2% uh, on the payment. So actually, I'm only making, you know, what is this? $2.94, not $3. But can I use that money the next day? Can you use that money the next day to make more than that 2% fee? That's up to you. Uh, and, and just just if you don't believe me, here, here is video. I actually use Payability. I signed up a while ago. In Q4, it is so extremely helpful to have money the next day. A lot of people who are older Amazon sellers can get next day payments, but you newer sellers can't have that. And, and even just to try it, they're paying you 250 bucks, but only if you click my link. The average uh, new bonus sign up is only $200, but I got you, I got you uh, in mind when I negotiated this contract and they're gonna pay you 250 bucks just to sign up. How awesome is that? That's the video guys. Uh, hopefully right here, you'll, you'll see some pertinent information probably, oh, you know what it's gonna be? It's gonna be a bolo. It's gonna be a bolo that I sold this week for more than 50 bucks. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it so much. If you like these videos, subscribe, join the Facebook group, all that jazz, and I'll see you guys later.